Hi there, once again, welcome back to my channel. Consider subscribing if today is your first time and don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorial. Today, I'm going to walk you through how to send bulk SMS using another amazing platform which I'm going to recommend to you. So you just go to this site called wiggle.com.gh. I found this platform to be so amazing as far as sending bulk SMS is concerned. So you can use this for your SMS marketing and then some amazing stuff. So under services, when you click under services, they have what you call bulk SMS. When you click on bulk SMS, it will take you to a new page like this. You first need to create an account. I find this, this so amazing because it, uh, it allows you to send bulk SMS to clients and other amazing services. Okay, so let's see how this platform works. So when you visit your dashboard, you log in, get access to options to be able to manage what you have, as you can see. So let's assume we want to send a bulk SMS. Just click on bulk messaging. When you click on that, it's going to give you option to send new message, send sent message. So message you send, you'll be able to monitor that schedules message, message you schedule. You can do that and you can create a sender ID. Basically, the sender ID is the name that will show once you receive a message. So let's say you receive a message from MTN to show us what MTN. If it's from basically the sender ID is the name you see when you receive a text message. Okay, so if it's from a contact, you see that contact. If it's from a name, let's say for instance, I, I send this as Adutech. You will not see my contact, but you see the message coming from what Adutech or PCF. So this platform allows you to create an um, amazing sender ID, customized one that you can use. Okay. So under book SMS, you can just go to send ID and then you click on what? add new send ID. So when you click on this, this is the option. Just type the name you want to use and indicate the services you want to use to offer. So they have both SMS and an email. In this case, I just want what? Uh, messaging SMS. So I just type the name of there and click on save. I have already created those that I want to use. And you can see once you create that, you'll be able to add address book. That's the contact you want to be sending your SMS to. So when you click on address book, with this address book, you can add this address book into what groups. So under address book, you can go ahead and then manage groups. Click on manage groups. So realize that when you click on manage groups, I have already created some two groups over here. I have PCF and then YAF. Okay. And then under YAF, I have 37 contacts and under PCF, 106 what 109 contacts you can go ahead and add new groups so let's say i want to add a new group i can just go ahead and then what click on this that's the add group icon and then give the name of the group so let me just say ypg so that's the name of the group and i'll just go ahead and then click on save changes so you can see i have a new group now created to the 30th but i currently don't have any contact on this so it's showing what's zero so you can easily import contact into this group that is where we have what import contact so when you click on this you can import contact into that group so let's try importing contact into this group and then we can send sms so you see under upload file you can select the group that you want to import your contact to in this case i want to import it into what ypg so just select that from the list So I've selected YPG and then I have to go ahead. So you need to import what Excel file. So take note of that. It should be what Excel file and then it should be more than what 25 megabytes. You'll click on upload and select your file. So just locate where you have your contacts. So basically you need to save these files into what Excel and I have some Excel folder here. I think I have some contacts over here. So I'll just click on this and then open this file. Just click on upload and it's going to upload this file into that contact. So as you can see, I have this, the contact will be imported neatly. And all I need to do is what click on what begin bulk contact import process. So I'll click on that and you can see I've imported all 103 contacts. Okay. None of them filled. So I can see everything where I do upload another file. If you have another file to do, you can go ahead and upload. So once you have this contact imported, you can go ahead and start, start sending bulk SMS. But before that, you need to, that you need to what, buy what bulk SMS and then to pay and then you can send that. So let's go ahead and then we we'll buy credit. So you need to buy credit. 
we have the i can check my balance and then i bought some the last time I bought some five cities so it's you have to indicate the country you are buying from and then if you go to settings you can do that so click on settings and then indicate your country so you can see currently i'm using ghana my country and then the code id code you have several several other countries you can select from so it's not limited to just ghana so i really want to use this so i can just go back to under credits you need to have what credit before you can do that so i click on balance i bought some the last time which we used to demonstrate how to send some bulk sms using this platform so you can see i really don't have cash but I have what bundle over here so I have bundle of five CDs, which is valid for 20 days. So with this, I'll be able to send up to 180 SMS. Okay. So this is my space is when it was expired. So it's going to expire on 17th May. So I'll make sure I use everything before that day. And if you want to buy a new book or a bundle to send book SMS, just go to purchase bundle. That's under credit. Click on that. So you can see this is where you can actually buy a bundle and then start sending what sms they have voice bundle they have marshall bundle so this is what i bought you can see the prices are there depending of the amount of volume maybe of data you'll be sending you will just specify and then buy the one you want so you can pay with credit card or you can pay with mobile money so assume i want to buy the which i have already bought i'll just click on and see details so you can see i have it here if you are buying for sale just go ahead so it says that there is a zone one message quantity 180 and i'll click on a purchase so this is what you need to do i'm paid so it's five cd just click on what click on to pay when you click on this icon over here it will open a new dialog box for you to pay okay so just click on this pay with mobile money or credit card and then you can go ahead and it will start sending what sms so in this case i have already done that so i'll go back to book sms and then we'll go to under this i'll go to send you message so this is where everything is going to take place so we need to specify the message we are sending uh, so we're going to send a sample message we have a sample message and you can click on that so click on message type so we want to send boss book sms to group remember we created a group a group already so if you want to select, select and send a message to a group just select groups and then under groups option select a group you want to send messages to so select that group and in this case i want to send it to maybe yaf so i'll just click on what yaf because i just want to send them a message and i want them to get that message i want them to make everything practical for you to see so the send id i need to select yaf and it's going to be a text message and then you need to what give it a, a subject to your message you want to give a subject to your message so you can go ahead and give a subject and then you can give the content of that message as well okay so what is going to be the content of that message you have to specify so i can just see yaf and then i'll type fellowship in in christ okay so i'll just type yaf fellowship in christ so basically you see the message character and then a amount that is going to be charged per message and i can go ahead and then i'll know how much is remaining and maximum length i can send I have a written word if you did want to add a subject basically the subject is what a person we've been see before opening the message i just want to leave the subject blank and then i can go ahead and then send this message you can schedule this message as well and you can specify when to send this message by clicking over here and i select the time you want to select send a message but i want my own instance so i'll just click over here and like i said i'll leave the subject blank and then i'll go ahead and click on the confirm So you can see this is the message it takes the sender id everything confirmation everything is here message that i'm sending so these are the contacts i have to send this message to and this is a bundle i'm going to use i have 180 and i'm using what 37 to send this message
So then I'm going to deduct this from this and I'll click on send message now. So you can see 37 messages sent successfully. So your message has been sent and you can view send messages, you can view schedule messages. So you can click on this to see if indeed this message has been sent. So let's see over here. You can see the status of every message has been delivered successfully, the time and everything. So if in this sense, this message. So this is basically how to send this. This issue with one of the contacts over you can see. So I can try resend this message. Okay. So this is basically how to send bulk SMS using this amazing platform. If you have anything to share with me or any information you have, just let me know at the comment section. Subscribe and don't forget to turn on the notification bell. Bye bye.